What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Champ. Just got home from the doctor's office. Uh, had my uh, two week follow up. Um, it went okay. Um, you see, I still can't uh, watch my son uh, by myself. Um, not quite yet, because, you know, he is at the stage where he's crawling. So, you know, he's all over the place and, you know, constantly picking him up and bending over is going to really strain, uh, put a lot of pressure and stuff on my back. So for at least, they said, at least two weeks um, not to watch him by myself. So he's going to be staying at my parents' house still. Um, I can lift to about 20 to 25 pounds, so I can't start weight training again, which I'm not even comfortable. I don't even have the mindset of weight lifting yet, like at all. Like I'm too afraid to do anything. Um... Yeah, so the weight limit increased 20 25 pounds. Um, on the stairs, no more than about 10 to 15 pounds. So um, so I got that down. Um, I can leave the house. I uh, can't really drive. Obviously, no, I can't drive while taking the pain medication. So I got to, you know, uh, do that. So I'm going to be kind of, I mean, at least I can get out the house, though. I can get out the house and go for walks. Um, they want me to start trying to walk more. And they want me to start trying to be more active just a little bit, though. I should take it easy. Um, but now I'm not really like vacuuming and sweeping cause that's going to really have me bending over and, um, a lot of st strain on the back. Um, not back at work yet. Not yet. Um, my next appointment is, um, in August, August 2nd, I think August 2nd. Um, uh, but I will be, you know, doing vlogs in between there. You know, we're, we're still, we're almost at the end of July. I think we have one more day, I think left of this month or I mean, end of June, end of June, we're at the end of June. So we have like one more day, I think. Um, so, uh, so yeah, so yeah, just give you guys an update. Um, it's going okay. Uh, I'm going to start trying to, uh, be more, be more active here at home. It's a little bit, try to do a little bit more things here just to see how my back is. But of course, you know, I got to listen to my body. Got to be smart about it. Cause I don't want another, like my dad said, like my dad said to my mom, you know, make sure you let him know, let champ know that, um, he needs to be extremely careful, you know? Um, you know, it's my back. I'm 28 years old and I'm having back surgery at 28 years old. Um, the likelihood of me having another back surgery, um, or having a, with a, uh, it's like a fusion, um, they don't know yet. It's still, it's still early, it's still early. So if I, if I rehab, um, early enough, um, if I rehab well, then no, having another back surgery is, is, it's not a likelihood, but that's one thing with the fusion surgery. They don't want to do that and they don't like to do that in younger people. Um, Physical therapy, they said they don't see the need for me to do physical therapy. Not yet, because it's so it's still two weeks out from the surgery. And they um they noticed that when they send people to physical therapy kind of right away after the surgery, it uh kind of basically aggravates that 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 area where they had the surgery at. So no physical therapy for now. But it kind of increased my my activities. Um some things didn't get increased, like like I said, I can't watch my son by myself. Just the fact of, you know, a change I have to bend over while changing him and um, like I said, I'm still having um, constant, um, I'm like, I just had to drive up. It was like a 45 minute drive to my doctor's appointment and just sitting in a car. I'm finally getting out of the car and it was just, it was, oh man, it's so uncomfortable on my back. So I'm about to take some pain medication and some muscle, muscle relaxer and just kind of lay on some ice, put some ice on my back and just go back to sleep for a little after I eat and go to sleep. Um, but yeah, man, if you guys, uh, thanks for the uh, tuning into my vlogs. Hopefully I'm... Um, I'm a uh, inspiration to some. I'm not giving up. Um, it's it's going to be a long journey. It's just a long recovery. But, you know, like I said, you know, champs have a road to recovery. Uh, but I'm not going to let this hold me back. I'm going to, you know, obviously listen to the doctor. But I'm, I plan on getting back to where I was before when I showed you guys the days leading up to my surgery. Lifting weights and being, like the, like the doctor said, um, or his, say his assistant. I met with the assistant today. You know, you're an active guy. And yeah, I, I want to get back to that. But it's... I'm 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 being smart. I'm not rushing into anything right now. Definitely not doing that. It's I, I just don't want another back surgery. I'm, it's my back. You know, like my dad said again. You know, I need to be careful. I, I don't want to end up paralyzed. You know, I have two kids. Have a great wife. You know, I definitely want to be able to watch my kids grow and um, watch them grow and be able to play around with them. You know, and you know, do things and be able to walk with my wife and dance with my wife and everything. You know, so I need to really be careful with my back and um, really take it easy. But all right, everybody, drop a like if you like because you know you like. And please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and uh, so you can keep up with my vlogging content. And also I have my, my gaming content that I upload too, me gaming. So again, everybody, please just drop a like if you like and uh, hit that subscribe button. It'll help me out a lot. All right, guys, peace.